Hey guys, this is Bernie Trahola with uh, DTI South Carolina, uh, a spatial software consulting and development company. Uh, today I want to introduce you DTI Map Hosting, our newest, latest product uh, we have for all kind of manifold GIS users. It basically enables you to share your manifold GIS projects in just a few minutes online with your friends or uh, colleagues. Uh, and to show you how that works, I'm just going ahead and give you a little example. I did prepare a manifold project which um, has two layers in it. It's uh, the United States states and the cities uh, greater than 100,000 citizens. Uh, we have a map in there. The map has got a layout uh, one and a layout two. We have a little query in there which uh, helps us to find a state and we have a few um, views um, that brings us to certain states on the map. Uh, that's basically it and uh, now I want to deploy that kind of map to the DTI map posting platform. Uh, therefore I just go ahead and uh, save it, put it on that hard drive here there we go. And once that is done, I switch over to the map hosting software. I lock myself in. Okay, and the password too. There you go. And once I'm in, I do get another tab with uh, um, all my maps I have already uploaded. It's only one right now. I got a limit of 50 megabyte, so there's some plenty of room to upload one more. And here's our manifold chess uh, project that I want to grab and just load it up. Well, this will take a little. There it is. And once it's uploaded, uh, I can go ahead and just click the map button and the GeoCockpit map server, which is another product of DTI, starts right away with uh, all the data inside. Uh, I still got my map uh, with all the layers, the cities, the states and its labels. Uh, I can turn them on and off. And I uh, also can use the little query to to find the state. Uh, Let's say Iowa. There we go. Now Iowa is selected. It opens up the uh, table. I also can zoom to Iowa now. Okay, to deselect, just deselect it. Go on full screen. Uh, I might want to do the manual way and select some states. Click here, states. Say it's a new selection. I could do all the others too. And uh, got the results right here all the states are listed in my attribute table. From there I can export it to KML, Shape or DXF um, and that allows me to exchange also the data that I share with my friends or colleagues online. I'll take a look at the views. There are the three views I created in my manifold project, South Carolina, Oregon and Iowa. That works too. I got a legion a legend of uh, all the data which is in the project and I also can do a print out and using the two layouts I created in my project. So as long as it's kind of standard layouts you're fine with it to, to use it on the DTI map hosting. If I fix that here I can also move let's say Indiana into it right into the middle uh, uh, and uh, just go ahead and print it as a PDF. Uh, there are also some more other functions in there. We see the scale, we can do measurements, uh, do a screenshot, um, like a copy-paste thing, and some other stuff too. It supports drawings and layers, vector and raster data, so uh, feel free to try it out. And um, let me know if you want to have a trial. Uh, looking forward to it. Thank you.